An attacker has opened fire on coalition forces. The Pentagon says one American has been killed. 15 coalition troops, including Americans, have been wounded. This happened at a camp in Kabul. We're told the attacker was wearing an Afghan military uniform, a so-called green on blue shooting. The situation still very fluid. I think we have CNN's chief national security correspondent, Jim Shuto, with us. Jim, you there? I am here, John. How are you? Listen, we have some, some more details on this now. One, uh, one American killed, and I can tell you now that that one American was a general officer, what we know as a, a general, so a senior officer, 15 other wounded, including Americans, as well as other nationalities in this attack. As you mentioned, uh, it was someone dressed up in an Afghan military uniform, still an open question as to whether it was an actual soldier. Uh, or a member of the Taliban, a terrorist, a, a militant who acquired a uniform and dressed up as a soldier. I'm told he was using a, a light, machine, light Russian machine gun, very heavy firepower in this attack. And this attack took place at a training center for Afghan military officers, members of the Afghan National Security Force in Kabul. Kabul. It's called Camp Karga. Uh, this really one of the keystone efforts of U.S. and coalition forces there is training the Afghan military to take over the security role after uh, U.S. and coalition forces leave. And these attacks, so-called green on blue attacks, uh, Afghan ally attacks on coalition forces, they've been a real problem there uh, over the last several years. And this one, one of the most, uh, most shocking ones with a very high, at this point, casualty toll.